The last couple of years, the Rangers have made numerous trades. Some are going to hit, some might not. When the Rangers traded Michael Grabner to the Devils, they acquired Igor Rykov, and they were able to package and move up to get Keandre Miller. What do you know about Rykov? Well, I talked to assistant general manager Chris Drury today, and you know, you look at the points that he's been putting up, second most among KHL defensemen age 21 or younger in his regular season, his three assists in the six playoff games. He likes his smarts. He really likes the way he skates the puck out of his zone and out of trouble in his first pass. Now, he's had a terrific season, that was a little bumpy at times because he was moved on a trade and he got traded to Sochi. He's actually playing for Suge uh, Zubov and that's pretty neat. 20 minutes a night, he's overplaying him, but that's helping the young defenseman. It's kind of bizarre how he was traded and how he didn't make Ska St. Petersburg out of training camp. You see him here at the World Juniors where he had seven points, but you do your homework on these guys and you find out that I think there was a little bit of a pressure point there with Shostorkin, who he was playing with at Ska, and both players, um, there are a little bit of stickiness with when they're traded, when they're being played. I mean, he was in the VHL at one point, but I did my homework and I used my shady Russian contacts, and I found out that they both have the same agent over there. Right. So you're wondering if there's maybe a little bit of pressure to keep the goalie. Both players want to come to North America, and you know how shady things get. My shady Russian contacts. <laughs> I love it.